Through a constant rain, search teams headed further east today, trudging through wooded areas in Chesterland and Manaway, looking for any clues that could lead them to 41 year old Pat Borelli. It's like finding a needle in a haystack. We don't know where, where to look. We just aimlessly wander around. Meanwhile, Pat's exhausted wife Kathy waited at the search headquarters in Richmond Heights. Next to the Villa di Barali banquet hall, Pat's business and the place he was last seen around 1.30 Monday afternoon. We just want everyone to just continue to keep their eyes open for him and please bring him home to us. The FBI says as many as 10 agents are investigating Barali's baffling disappearance as part of the Violent Crimes Task Force, but they're not sure if foul play is involved and there's still Still no sign of the blue Dodge minivan with the license plate takeout that Pat drove away in. Kathy says the not knowing is taking a toll on their three children. It's just so hard. I mean, they just, they don't understand it. They've, I mean, their father has never been gone. They just want to see him. They just want to see his face. We just need people to, to come out, help us get out of their cars if they see anything. The search will resume Sunday morning. The family has also set up a Bring Pat Back website and Facebook page. Kathy says in her heart, she believes her husband is alive somewhere. I've been praying on it and I just, I believe he's okay and he just needs help getting home. In Richmond Heights, Bob Jones, News Channel 5.